So in this problem, we're going to do a projectile that's fired at an angle uh, 45 degrees at 300 meters per second. So we split it into x and y and look at our x and y initial velocities and other givens that we have. The first part of this problem wants us to find what is the maximum height of this projectile. Now at the maximum height, the final velocity in the y direction is zero. So we're going to use that and uh, figure out our maximum height. We don't have time, so that's why we use this equation. Now once we find the maximum height, the next thing we're supposed to find is how long is it in the air. There's two approaches here. We could either find the time it takes to get to the peak, the height we just found, or we could say we're finding the time when the delta y is zero because it starts and ends on the same height. We're going to do that approach. So here we don't have final velocity, although you could make an assumption to find that, but we don't have to. There's several ways to do this. Uh, we do this algebra, and we come down and we get our total amount of time that our ball is in the air. Next, we're looking for the horizontal range. There's no acceleration in the x direction, so we just plug in what we have into this equation and get our horizontal range.